Nelson Mandela is known for many things, but not usually for his artwork. This week, the revered statesman and recipient of the Nobel Peace Prize will headline a unique contemporary African art auction in New York. Giles Papiot spent several months assembling his contemporary and modern African art sale, entitled Africa Now. It is the first commercial auction of pieces from sub-Saharan Africa in the United States by any of the major houses. We've got about uh, 130 paintings here, uh, which vary in value from as little as two or three thousand dollars up to the most expensive one I think is about eighty to a hundred thousand dollars. It's a market that is still very nascent. It's, it's really still growing and it seems extraordinary that here we are in 2010. It's the first ever sale to be held in New York. One of the biggest draws of the sale is a complete set of lithographs by the former South African president which illustrate images from Mandela's incarceration on Robben Island as a political prisoner. The sketches, originally done in 2002 to raise funds for his foundation, are the first full set to ever come to auction, which means no one can accurately forecast their value, though estimates start at 45,000 US dollars. The sale also features some of Africa's most exciting artists, whose work has been sold by Bonhams in London. There are 137 works by 78 artists from 14 countries. The Bonhams auction of contemporary and modern African art sale takes place March the 10th. Yang Ran, CCTV.